Hello, dear brothers and sisters. Thank you for joining Mother and Refuge of the End Times. We would like to share with you a locution from our Lord Jesus Christ to Anne, a lay apostle. Come, Holy Spirit. Enlighten our minds to discern and to live in the most holy will of God in all things, that no evil may prosper through us or against us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Our Lord said to Anne, People begin to see only the human structure of my church on earth. They forget about me, the King of the Church. They forget about my purpose and what I came to do. I came to free people from an oppressive human structure which claimed to represent my Father. Over time, we established moments of direct contact with me for those called to bring my love and consolation to the world. These sacraments are intended to fill people with my love so they can bring it to others. Instead, many fail to exhale my love into the world and become bloated with self-importance and arrogance. This recreates the very thing I came to stop. Many people do not and will not share in our understanding of the Father's love through the Catholic religion. They will not understand my position as king of this church, but they will notice our example and our love for them, if indeed we possess that love and offer it freely. If we are faithful to the Father's plan for this church, many will come to understand the Father's gift of my presence in the Eucharist. Will you help me? People must not misuse religion for self-gratification. They must allow it to humble them for the Father's plan, which is a plan of love for all humanity. Immaculate Heart of Mary, pray for us. In 2003, soon after accepting Our Lady's request that she work for Christ, Anna Lay Apostle became a victim soul and began experiencing mystifying illnesses as well as the gift of interlocutions. Despite exhaustion and much suffering, Anne established the Apostolate of the Returning King, a far-reaching rescue mission for souls centered on our Lord's messages. Following a two-year commission to investigate their authenticity, Anne's writings and messages now carry an official church imprimatur from the local ecclesiastical authority and, by sacred decree, the Apostolate received canonical recognition as a private association of the faithful with juridical personality. Anne is a wife, a mother of six, and a third order Franciscan. Brothers and sisters, please see the description below for links to our Telegram, Facebook, Signal, and Rumble pages. May God bless you and keep you. Amen.